This is Twit. Well, this is, um, it's called Showcast. Uh, I made this a while ago um, because I'm, um, when I give presentations, I move my hands quite a lot. Um, and uh, at one point I thought, well, I should be able to give presentations using just my phone and a Chromecast. I mean, we, we're living in the future, aren't we? Um, so uh, I tried it just with my phone and a Chromecast and that didn't work. So I made this app and basically it's a presentation app. Um, now, the first thing you can do is to pick uh, your slides. Um, yeah. And you have to find on your phone some slides and some notes. Exactly. Now, this is in this version of the app, the uh, only drawback um, that you actually have to have your slides uh, and notes as pictures on your phone. So if you've got a PowerPoint presentation, you've got to add that, um, uh, convert that to a JPEG or PNG, move it to your phone. Um, and uh, yeah, you can go pick your notes as well. Um, the reason it doesn't yet work with PowerPoint and that kind of thing is, uh, or Google Slides um, is actually going to be fixed because I talked to a guy from uh, or the, the guys from the G Suite at Google, and they said, well, uh, you know, you can just, why don't you just download a picture of the, uh, the slide, of uh, your Google slide slide? And I said, well, that function doesn't exist. Uh, and they went, ah, it does, it does. And I went like, no, it doesn't. So you get three Googlers looking down and uh, looking at me and going like, oh, you're right, this function doesn't exist. Let's build it for you. So very soon you will be able to use this with Google Slides. Anyway, once you've got your uh, pictures uh, sorted, selected, your slides and your notes, you can uh, start the presentation. And if you had um, a, uh, a Chromecast, um, on the top right, there'd be a button where you'd connect to your Chromecast. And what that would do is your, no your slides are in the top left, yeah, and your notes are in the bottom right. Um, and only your slides uh, would show up on the Chromecast screen. Um, now, what that means is um, you can now uh, slide along. So uh, if you'd uh, go to the next slide, see, um, you see that your notes and your slides are kind of in sync. Can you enlarge the, um, the slides? Uh, bottom left? No, uh, the slides. Can you go to the? Yeah, exactly. Now, do the same thing. Zoom in on the, no, on the slide. Yeah. Now that will show up exactly like it shows on your phone on your presentation device. So this could be a Beamer, this could be a large TV, uh, whatever. So you can uh, zoom about, zoom in, uh, pan about. And then when you're ready to go to the next slide, you just go to the next slide, give it a flip. And you can do that on the slide or on the note. And as you can see on your bottom right, those are your notes and you can, you know, read what you were going to say about the slide. And only the slide shows up on the tele uh, television. Only this Beamer. top image would show up on Chromecast ever. This is just for my reference so I can describe what I'm seeing up there and what everybody's seeing up there. Exactly. Nice. Um, and I use it myself uh, for smaller presentations. The one thing it's not good at is when you're in a huge conference hall uh, because of all the Wi-Fi interference. Uh, but if you're um, just in a normal office setting, uh, you can yeah have your slides, your notes uh, on your phone. And um, yeah, all you really need is a phone and a Chromecast and you don't have to lug about uh, a bag filled with a tablet or a laptop or whatever. That's so awesome. that's it. That's awesome. It uh, takes a little bit of time to prep. Like I, I did this super quick. So obviously it's just like a screenshot of my notepad or a text edit or whatever. But yeah, you have to kind of prep your notes and turn that into an image so that it syncs up and, and everything. But yeah, that is, that is the one thing. Um, I mean, I'm, as I said, I'm working on uh, integrating Google slides and it will get there. Yeah. But now you just, if you've got any presentation, you just convert it to a picture uh, a series of picture, put it on your phone, uh, select it, and you're good to go. Awesome. So um, I hope, uh, yeah, people uh, like it and use it. 
Uh, and there is, um, yeah, there's a free version and there's a paid version. Um, they both do exactly the same at the moment. Only the free version does have a little um, uh, extra message on the bottom, a little watermark on the bottom of the Chromecast uh, screen when you're using it to present. Oh, okay. Nice. So just a fair warning for those of you who want to use it right away. Uh, you might want to get the paid version uh, if you're going to do an actual presentation for business people and that kind of thing. Which, I mean, I, I hate to break it to you guys because this is this is going to break the bank. It's $1.87 when I pulled up the paid version. Oh, and man. And if you're presenting to business people, you might not have that kind of money. <laughs> yeah, Expense accounts aren't what they used to be. <laughs> Just get the paid version. Uh, it's called Showcast. Uh, very good. That's awesome. I love. The, I love the idea of you know developers, people who can develop, creating a tool that fills their own need. Because I guarantee you, if you need a tool that does that, there are plenty of other people that do too.